What is going on everybody and welcome to the video. So today I want to talk about the most recent Kingdom Hearts news that we've actually received, which is Square Enix posting new job listings. My source for this information, as always, is KH13.com, and I will link the article in the description for you to take a look at for yourself. Now, I'm not going to go over the entire article or the job listings in great detail, but long story short, they are looking for members to join the Osaka team to work on the next Kingdom Hearts project. They are looking for UI designers, tech designers, and technical artists. Now, we don't know for sure what the next game is or what it will be. Nomura, after Kingdom Hearts 3 released, said that there was going to be at least one game before Kingdom Hearts 4. He also said around the time of the release of the last Remind trailer that he got asked to do a special project, which is a third line within the Kingdom Hearts series. Now, we have no idea what that truly means, so we'll have to wait to get more information on that. I've always figured that the next console game for Kingdom Hearts that we were going to get would be something along the lines of a Kingdom Hearts Unicross HD game, or just something to do with the Kingdom Hearts Unicross storyline in general. We could play as Ephemer perhaps, but who really knows what it could actually be. The idea of this third line makes me think that the next game could possibly be something brand new to the series. So aside from Sora and the gang's current line after Kingdom Hearts 3 and the Kingdom Hearts Union Cross storyline, we might get something completely new that will eventually tie into these two ongoing stories. I mean, it's fairly obvious that Kingdom Hearts Union Cross and the current line after Kingdom Hearts 3 are coming together. And I'm sure that the Remind DLC will cover those connections, if not at least some of them. But this new third line could introduce a new world, new characters, and potentially a new story that might influence the turn of events within the current line of Union Cross and after Kingdom Hearts 3. Those are just some of my quick thoughts. I'm very excited to even entertain the idea that the next Kingdom Hearts game is essentially beginning development and it could be closer than we think. So the burning question is, when will we get the next game? As in, when will we get it revealed to us? Like I said, Kingdom Hearts Union Cross still has quite a bit left more to it. I believe Nomura said something about it being halfway over, but I could be a little bit wrong on that. All I know is that there's two main scenarios that are done, and there are two main scenarios left, but who really knows how long that that's actually going to take. And also the foreshadowing of it coming together with Kingdom Hearts 3, it doesn't really seem like the story is wrapping up anytime soon. But if they release this new line perhaps, while Kingdom Hearts Union Cross is still going on, it can hold us over while it finishes up. I seriously doubt that they'd rush it given the fact that Kingdom Hearts Union Cross has been going on for so long, it's very popular, and a lot of people play it and put their money into it, so I don't really see them ending the game's life anytime soon. Uh, it'd probably be like something like us waiting for Kingdom Hearts 3 and then playing Kingdom Hearts Union Cross while it updates and giving us more of the story and all that junk. So Kingdom Hearts Union Cross would probably continue on while this other game is in development and while this next game releases. In all honesty, I could see them maybe revealing the title with a short little trailer at E3 this year 2020. I don't think it'd be too soon, and Square Enix is known for revealing games while they're still early in the stages of development. Us Kingdom Hearts fans, for example, know that all too well. So a reveal at E3 2020 definitely seems realistic to me. Like I said, it could be some sort of Kingdom Hearts Union Cross game, or it could be this new line that I was just talking about. It can go in either direction, I will be very happy. I mean, it can really be anything and I'll be happy given the fact that it's a new Kingdom Hearts game and that's always very exciting. But anyways guys, that is the end of the video. Just wanted to bring this piece of information to your attention. Please check out the article down below in the description and go to KH13 to get the full gist of what's going on. Let me know what you guys think about the next Kingdom Hearts project being in development and let me know what you think it will be. Don't forget to do that, like the video, and most importantly, subscribe to the channel for more Kingdom Hearts content. Thank you all so much for watching and until the next video, I will catch you all later. Bye bye.